Okay, so we're getting into it. My name is Al Raymond, my name. So you're not gonna, <laughs> you're gonna need a minute. Okay, you gave yourself a minute to freak out because of the monster. The thing with all the legs and teeth. Yeah, that one. The only one you barely got away from. Minutes up though. Ah, oh. you take a deep breath. Let the uncertainty slip away into the toothy, arm wiggling darkness and focus on what you know. Your name is Joey, Joey Carly. You live just outside the town of Huntswitch. Hauntwitch. You are, in no particular order, a puzzle solver, a semi-orphan, a dancer of multiple skills, an inspiring veterinarian, and a big sister. Speaking of, that monster, the one that barely missed eating you alive, only you're not thinking about that right now, and may you be headed back outside where your little brother is, you've got to warn him. Yeah. It's a... Baby, your babysitter gave you this for your birthday, Joey. She said, "This wizard's the best. He's so good. He lives in this little wizardly orb, just swimming in spells and glitter. He will protect you. Look, he's doing it right now. Your babysitter loves wizards. Obviously, she's pretty great. That's pretty cool. So how do? I, that's how I move. You just click. Uh, that looks important." Your babysitter got you this junior veterinarian's medikit. It's kind of important to you. You think you'll, you think you'll leave it here for now. It would be really bust you up if something happened to it. <gasps> Panda bear. One day you hope to be a veterinarian. That is that something outside? That oh, they've got bats. Then you could be the one caring for the fuzzy faced baby critters so when someone catches you in the act snuggling them all and tells you to take a hike you can flash your vet badge and say you're here in professional medical business <laughs> then they'll have to take the hike not you ah <laughs> uh, oh what the bean bags are made for big come back lately it beats sitting on the floor so you can really ask of a bean bag no what's this this is sir bappy Post, post water. I forgot about those. <laughs> Your beloved man, fro chap. Oh jeez, you tend to, you tend to his fuzzy whims and needs. When you're in trouble, you imagine what that they might be. What a daring dream to combine the finest qualities of the animal kingdom with the nobility and of human animals. Wait, you mean humanity? Anyway, Sir Bappy Pawswater will have to tend to his own fuzzy whims and needs for a while. You got a lot of crap on your plate around. Yeah, there's a big monster outside. It's all black and green. Cool color design. It actually looked really cool. Uh, we're gonna die. Oh, I did check everything on the other side of the room. That's good. Oh, there's more. Yikes, more of them. G gentrification is a real monster. Uh, blistering social commentary aside, you sincerely hope you and your brother aren't killed and eaten by these eyeless small horrors. <gasps> Don't go. Poor puppy. Oh, if that icky sneak thing hurt her, well, well, you'd use your birthday veterinary skills to patch up uh, her up and make it all better. You'd also be very angry. Right now, she doesn't seem to want to come out of her doghouse. You don't blame her. Yikes, more than them, Jeremy. <sighs> that looks like a monster there. Uh, remember when you're ranking up, breaking up those leaves, your dog knocked you over, you, and you laughed, then everything turned to monsters. Ah, memories. <laughs> It'd be nice if those monsters were as weirded out by the, the weird skill found as you were. Unfortunately, that thing there is probably monster chick. Wait, chick? Chick, yeah. Looks like you'd scurry the prom- <laughs> Looks like he- whoa. Did you see that? This guy went black for a minute. Uh, to get away from that thing, unsurprisingly, he acts like it's his mission to control him up there. As if a good goofy kid can legitimately have any secret business of that sort. That seems important though, there. Uh, you barely muse the before signation of flashing light. What could it represent? The past, the future, America. It's your stupid brother, he needs to get in touch with him. The sun has just set, making for a glorious autumn eve. As such, autumn. Autumnal evening glory radiates from the heavens, kissing the clouds on its way down to earth. Stupid clouds, all untouchable and inferior and stuff. 
Let's see. Alright, so the bats are going to come by. There we go. This... Ah, oh, I thought I clicked them. A magical animal companion here rescues your favorite jam... Japanimation. Japanimation. <laughs> oh, that's good. It's all about this girl, Shika, who goes to school sometimes and has a regular life boring. Yeah, but whatever magical animal has been hurt, Shika becomes Princess Shika and writes her dear companion to heal them. Uh, that whole thing, it's great. No fine, no just healing. You love it. So yeah, she's just like a big goofy dork who loves healing animals. Usually don't have that much of a record in here to count of the humdrum life you lead, but you f you f you thinks today will be a different story. Maybe you should take a moment to record that note now, just in the case your last chance to set down the final words before your tragic demise at the hands of a horrible sneaky thing. Maybe. Or, you know, perhaps, just, maybe I just run. The little girl there, she's destined for big things, big hopes, big fears, big worries, big loneliness. Now, hold on, pull yourself together. What would, you, what would your mom say if she knew you were thinking like that? You really wish you knew. Oh. Since you've been gotten, you've been less and less pa of pa over the years. Guess he's uh, greener pastures to move on to, or bluer beauties. Oh, that's, I'm really sad now. It's locked. Gain access your long buried, recently buried secrets. You'll have to find the diary key. You really like the poster, but can't really see why. It's pretty, and you like the expressions of the ballerina's face. You wonder if this is what it's like when adults go to museums to look at actual art. You hope so. Yeah, I really. Uh, this is making me remember that whole um, Homestuck series. This is obviously based off of a ton of this stuff. Just like lots of little character things and probably a lot of unnecessary shit you don't really need to know but it's there. This game is to get four of your colored circles in a row before your opponent who's trying to do the same. You can also theoretically connect five if you're that kind of showy jerk. <laughs> it's not connect four, it's connect five. Holy shit, it's the 90s. You really gotta, ch you could get charge it this game, it's kind of bossy though. <laughs> Appreciate. You're under good heart stare. Yeah, you appreciate the heck out of this art. It would be difficult if not impossible for anybody to appreciate it more. Can I save? I should save actually. Just in case. Well sure by not after this after this though, you should really go and get a walkie-talkie since you just remembered your cannibalized the batteries from your walkie to power this game, okay? That's enough yelling. Oh, it's actually Okay, you can you can actually play it. That's pretty cool. Okay, looks like the green button isn't working. Nostal <laughs> Nostalgia satisfied. Might as well salvage the batteries. <laughs> oh, look at all these game consoles. You love the video game console. You're a computer games enthusiast at heart, but you can't help but enjoy the tact tactile sensation of the control in your hands as you fight evil and save animals and etc. Lots of etc. Am I talking too fast? Large collection of tiles for your console's hungry, card shaped mouth. All the best ones here. Well, all the ones you happen to own are here. You, you could spend all day listening to them. There's Bubs Bay, there's... Mentioning Bubs, it makes you feel a little qu queasy. So you think you'll stop there. You might as well lie down for a bit, actually. Oh, I made her sick. Uh, hungry Hungry Hippos. It's, it's My Little Pony. That thing. <laughs> Bean bags. Uh, I don't know what the little green thing is. Uh, I'm... This is a well-designed room. I like it. It's pretty cool. It's a change, I guess. Should try on some new clothes, but that's a style montage without at least one party offering could compulsory reaction shots for each outfit. What's going to have your infirming head nod when you finally nail it? Nothing important to consider because it's style montage. Puppy surprise is having puppies. So many. That's the surprise. Puppy surprise. Puppy surprise. Alright, whenever you look at this thing, the song from the commercial runs through your head like a snake monster of an autumn afternoon. 
That's a great place to stash your keepsakes, where they stay in safe and... Oh, so there's gonna be things. And... Puppy surprises having puppies. Oh, there's the key. Oh yeah, maybe you should take this beautiful weird on your mum clothes. Wait. Oh, that's creepy. Just a feeling, a deep, inescapable feeling. I must have skipped over that by accident. Uh huh. Mum had one mum won this award around the same age as you for being the best of Balor. Ballet, it's prey. There's a wizard. Wizard man, wizard man. So, let's go into the inventory. Yeah, that looks suspicious as frick. It's familiar from Homestuck. That's definitely from Homestuck, that one. Uh I can't remember what it is though. I don't think it's good. You unlock and open the diary. Nice juicy secrets here to come. Except it's just boring secrets, so you don't so you don't care. Look. Usually don't have much to record in this on the account of the humdrum life. Also just says the same thing. Wait, is that? Not Rose. Jane? No, shit, I forgot a lot of Homestuck. <laughs> That's the, uh, the alcoholic one. Maybe something from your past will shed some light on today's trauma, ter terror mysteries, trauma mystery. Yeah, basically the same thing. From a little detail mentioned offhand and forgotten, the key kicking casual cascade of connections that terminates a catastrophe of snake monsters. Uh-huh. April 13th, 1994. Dear Diary, no hum. Nothing much happened today. I tried to make some new friends at school to maybe expand our social circle beyond just me and Jude's friends all the time. Wait, is it weird to call my brother's friends my social circle? Ah, well, you know what I mean, Diary. I don't have any friends I can really call mine, so I'm just trying to branch out. Ah. I guess it's better than calling my web ring. Oh! The kids at school are jerks though. They call me a, a poser when I try to talk to them about games I like and stuff. Between you and me, I think a bunch of the kids at school might be evil. Jeez, I'm sounding all paranoid like my brother. They're just no good. I can feel it. Up to no good. Making trouble in the neighborhood. Got into one little fight. My hype mom got scared. She said don't go to that little dimension where that big skeleton man is. I'm stuck up weird, man. It got super weird. I, I don't remember everything. And I don't remember names, but I remember traits, which is good, I guess. Character traits. Uh, I remember Gamzee. You can never forget Gamzee. Uh, June 12th, 1994. Dear Diary. Phew. First day of summer vacation. I can't wait to take a break from all the, these clowns at school. Some. Sometimes I think I need a vacation from humanity. I don't like that mention of clowns. That, 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 that scares me a little. I can't believe it. I haven't recorded an entry since the beginning of the last summer. Needless to say, I've come back to school for a while now. Next summer can't come soon enough. I came home to a drunk babysitter again today. Sure is some quality adult supervision we youngsters are getting around here. Yeah! Oh shit, that's right! Uh, the drunk one, she was like really into wizards and shit. Oh, this is gonna end badly. <laughs> this is this is not gonna end well. I came to a drunk baby, sorry. Uh, she means well enough though. Haven't heard from Pa in weeks. Last we saw of him, he popped into the house and dropped off stupid mummies and globes or whatever. Then skipped off to go on more adventures. What a bozo. Also, how lame is it that he made us call him Pa instead of Dad while we were growing up? I miss Mom. Sad face, sad face. Joey. If this is going to be the last entry in your diary, then a gum, you're gonna... But then by a gum, you're gonna scare the bejesus if whoever finds it once you're a snake child. November 11th, 1994. Dear Diary. Forgive my hasty and never scribbling. I'm kind of scared, but maybe a bit excited. Anyway, we can't talk much now. There's a sly and cunning monster in the prowl. Possibly hungry for kid meat, too, so I've got to... Okay, I don't have a darn clue what I have to do, but I'll fill you in later once I do it. Joey. Satisfied. You're right, 
You write down the worst that could happen, you relock your diary and hide the key again, safe and sound. A prodigious collect prodigious prodigious collection of titles. A prodigious prodigious collection of tit fuck. A prodigious A large collection of tiles 